This is Jiwa, an hour away from the Abuja city center. The town is plagued by poor sanitary conditions with blocked drainages littered across the town and a lack of basic amenities. These are the realities the residents have had to live with for years. All these local midway free, these people, they are charging, their prices are too exorbitant. When somebody just put to bed, they call it 15, 16, 20. No water, no nepa, no health facilities. Jiwa is just one of the many suburbs in the FCT with similar stories of almost non-existent healthcare services. And the poor sanitary conditions are making the situation worse. However, things might be looking up for the residents of Jiwa as 70 medical personnel from the United States of America are here to flag off a medical outreach for the residents of Jiwa, Tungwa Kwaso, and Kubwa which will last for six days and is free of charge. A development which the Emir of Jiwa says is a blessing to the town. Today the medical teams are here. Neurologists are there, pharmacists are there, cardiologists are there, and so on. We are a, a rich man that has money, go outside and look for them. Look at their common man has captured them in, in the Chua kingdom. From the United States and speaking at the event, the leader of the team of medical professionals and president of the Association of Nigerian Physicians in America gives us an idea of the scope of medical services to be provided and why they have embarked on this mission. We intend to see at least 30, 300 to 400 cases per location each time with the surgical cases anywhere from 20 to who knows what we do. Last year we were able to do 80 cases in five days. This year we intend to do maybe 120, 150 cases of surgical cases in five to six days. We intend to take care of up to 3,000 people or more. We have to see what happens. Very excited. The Minister of Health is also grateful for the outreach. He calls for more partnership from other healthcare providers and urges citizens of the FCT to take advantage of the treatment to be provided. This is um, the outcome of um, a well planned um, strategy to network with our people in the diaspora so that they can give back to the community. And we are quite happy that uh, the turnout is uh, huge, very impressive and uh, I think our people will be the beneficiary. About 70% of Nigeria's health budget is spent in urban areas, where about 50% of the population reside. This poses a burden on healthcare delivery in rural areas like Jiwa. The Global Burden of Disease Study for Nigeria states that 5 million deaths in 2016 alone were as a result of poor quality healthcare. Initiatives such as this one from this multidisciplinary team of healthcare professionals is a big help. However, infrastructural gaps must be filled to see any real progress in healthcare delivery in Nigeria. Kayla Megwa, Channels Television News.